parallel wires bearing current in the same direction attract each other if you know what I mean but when the current in those wires flows in opposite directions they repel so don't break the Fuck. 
Martha, what's the matter? Oh, all that talk about young men today not wanting to go into business or do anything respectable, I, I couldn't help but think of... of... Dingo. Dingo? Yes, Robert. Uh, Richard. Our son, Dingo. What's the matter with him? He's a folk singer. No kidding. Yes, he sings in a coffee house. They're always giving him testimonial dinners after every millionth record he sells. And here he is, the guest of honor at this testimonial dinner, the one and only Dingo. Now I guess you cats want me to lay a few of my hit tunes on you. So I will. This here is my first hit. Yeah, I made this my third hour in show business. It was a gas and it was a smash. Do you remember? I protest this world we live in. I protest the sky of blue. I protest the man from uncle. And honey, I protest you. I protest Miss Larry Poppin. Jotkins and Lawrence Welch too, and I protest every one of us, St. Louis Cardinals, and honey, I protest you. I protest, I protest every minute of the life I lead. I protest everything and everybody, regardless of race or color or creed. I protest the world of business. General Motors, General Sarnoff, and General Electric, too. And I protest Mr. Richard Burton. And honey, I do protest you. I protest you. <laughs> that's all right. That's all right. Maybe you remember my second Sacco Bopo smash. A simple little love song of my own authorship. Called We're 21. Yeah. We're 21. Why can't they see? We're 21. Let them leave us be. We're 21. I say it again and again. We're 21. She's 11 and I'm 10. <laughs> you music lovers now I'd like to get a little serious because I know that you hippies will understand what I mean when I say that this life is fleeting and someday we must all go to that great big I go go in the sky well at that great big I go go in the sky where we'll all be together by and by cause I know the righteous brothers will be sprouting silver wings and we'll all be hushed and reverend as Elvis Presley sings at the great big I go go in the sky yeah that great big I go go in the Pygmalion, the story has often been told. He made the girl Galatea out of an ivory mold. Then he longed to be held and was glad to behold. The girl he made with a sculptor's knife had most obligingly come to life. Now I've made an ivory trio 
the way that Pygmalion made his. But sadly, I'm left to discover that ivory does as ivory is, and all of my loverly statues are bound and determined to be unavailable to me. What good are they? Unavailable to me. Absolutely available. 